Hey y'all, uh, Chris Evans here with the King and Archer team and Select Realty. Wanted to um, talk quickly, tell a little short story, uh, and hopefully leave you with a little bit of value when it comes to choosing a realtor. Uh, because if you've been paying attention to anything that's happening in the market, you know that there are plenty of brokerages being sued for commissions and how commissions work. Now, I'm not gonna go into what other brokerages do or what they charge because, frankly, it's none of my business. But I do wanna tell you a quick story about how listening, active listening, uh, cost two agents a really good deal uh, and how listening to the consumer's needs is best for business, and that's what we do. So I'm gonna talk about how this happens. So I've, I've got a gentleman I've been in touch with for the last nine months or so. And this person um, has a house to sell, post-divorce, very smart guy, um, in the one to two million dollar range home. And uh, post-divorce, so you've got the, the, the ex-wife and the ex-husband, and they're both interviewing their own professionals um, throughout this whole time. And we've kind of gone back and forth, and I'm on the short list along with, you know, another one agent. So there were two of us. Um, and it was looking like the other agent might have got it, mostly because I didn't get the FaceTime with, with the ex-wife. Um, and she was just going to acquiesce to keep the peace and calm communication. Until uh, a few days ago, they get an offer. Their property is not listed, by the way. It's off market. Another agent comes into this mix. So now there's three of us. There's an agent representing a buyer. There's myself just over here answering questions when they need it. Uh, and then there's the agent that they were likely going to list with this spring. Well, the terms of the offer were great and the expectations that the buyer's agent set with them were in line with what they were looking for. Flexibility on schedule. They can't sell right now. They need time. Well, they thought they were gonna get the deal done, so they called the other agent that they were gonna list with, and they said, hey, we think we got the property sold. We're, we're not gonna need you right now. So here's where the agent failed to listen and uh, made a big mistake. This agent has no paperwork signed. This is the one that they're planning the list. So the future listing agent demands to be a part of the transaction and demands to be paid a commission. Not going to talk about what that percentage is, but follow the lawsuits. I'm sure you can guess. Um, demands. No paperwork signed. No active listening happening from the agent. She's not listening to what's the, what the potential client is saying. She say, she's letting it go in one ear, out the other, and all she cares about is her bank account. So that was problem one. And uh, that that agent lost any chance of future business, so I'm told, uh, by how she acted. Now, problem two is the buyer's agent. Uh, so the buyer's agent said that they had this flexibility, set the expectations falsely, because they were very close to having a deal, the sellers had countered on a few terms, mostly timeline related. And uh, the buyers came back and said, no, we want the property much faster, we're not gonna be flexible, like the agent said they would. Um, and they don't need the property till the summer, but they wanted it now. So that ended up killing that deal. And a phone call comes to me and we talk. And we talk about empathy and we talk about sales training and how we teach our agents. Um, we talk about listening. And um, now in a couple of weeks, we'll be invited out to go and tour the property and get it ready to come to market. What, why I bring commissions into this, one is because the agent demanded it. Two is because uh, when I got the call yesterday, the concern was, hey, Chris, we got a lot, we got a lot of needs here um, and we're gonna need some extra, extra services. And by the way, is there any way we can make this happen for under 6%? I said, absolutely. Why did I say absolutely? Because the way that I charge is based off of my time, my effort, how much money we're spending, 
and how, how much work the seller wants us to do. Now, there are some baseline services that we cannot skimp on, right? I'm never gonna skimp on photos. I'm never gonna skimp on making sure that the pricing is accurate. We're always gonna make sure that our listing conveys to the buyer, the end user, that they can gauge the house. They can understand the house and whether they would wanna live there from the comfort of their home. Gotta do that. As for everything else, there's plenty of things that we can customize our, uh, our fees based off of. If our sellers don't want us doing an open house every weekend, guess what? We're not gonna do an open house every weekend. If our sellers don't need us to spend, you know, thousand dollars on ads on their, to get their household, guess what? I'm not gonna spend a thousand dollars on ads to get their household. And those things can come out. Um, so if you are thinking about selling your house this year, if you want to know um, what it's like to work with somebody who's independent, who owns their own company, and who knows how to listen to what you're, you're trying to accomplish, give me a call. We'd love to sit down and talk to you. Um, you know, I've had several of my clients give rave testimonials that said, you know, the, the first 20 minutes I spent with you was the most beneficial or effective use of my time with a realtor that I've ever had. So if you really wanna know what this process is like with a pro who's not gonna waste your time, give us a call. Or go to kingandarcher.com and click on the um, Start Listing tab. We'd love to talk to you about your property, your needs, and whatever we can do to help you in real estate. And now if you're a buyer, same thing. You want somebody who's gonna negotiate on your behalf? And uh, if, you're, if you're looking for that, I'll make another video telling you a story about how we can do that as well. Uh, but same thing, give us a call or go to kingandarcher.com and um, give us, there, just fill out the contact form and we'll be right back in touch with you. Uh, by the way, you can check the home search there at kingandarcher.com because it's pretty spectacular. We've got a great tool um, and we'd hope that you use it. I hope you have a fantastic day. Uh, Chris Evans, again, the team lead here at the King & Archer team and principal broker, co-owner of Select Realty in Marietta, Georgia, where we service the entirety of the metro Atlanta, but specialize in East Cobb and the Northeast Metro. Hope you have a great day. We'll see you soon.